a great day! I love our jobs! I'm pumped! Who else is pumped? Oh, I'm pooped. By the time I close up, I have no energy left. You need energy? You ask this berry. You, me, tomorrow morning. It's gonna be epic! Do I have a choice? Nope. It's what friends are for. See you bright and early. Um, what did I agree to? I'm all about being the best me I can be. And now I can help Shortcakes be the best she, she can be. What are Berry Besties for? <laughs> Where's the butters and croissants? Morning, Shortcakes! It's 4 a.m., which means it's... Time to sleep four more hours. Let's go, go, go! Get dressed and get a move on! <laughs> this was a mistake. I should have... <laughs> to work out. So, so let me just get this straight. I tell you I'm exhausted, and your solution is more exhaustion? Huh, funny. Let's go. <sighs> <sighs> Shortcakes? Oh. I give up. I still have no energy and it's been what, days? Weeks? 20 minutes. What? Orange, thanks for the offer, but exercise is clearly your thing. And I think we can both agree that it is definitely not my thing. Uh -huh. I don't get it. Friends are supposed to do things they like together, but she hates working out and I love it. I love fitness the way she loves baking. Oh. Ah! Orange? Why? Come on, I got you. Trust me? Do I have a choice? Huh? What is all this? You'll see. Working out is not your thing, but fitness is important. And since your thing is baking, we're gonna get you stronger doing what you do best. Go! Another! Again! Push it! You got it! Orange made a workout just for me! Hey, we should make workouts for each of you. Lime can lift books, Blue Ray can do arts and crafts relay. Lemon, we can squat truck engines! Uh, <laughs> Orange, I think maybe you energized her a little too much. It's the endorphins. Just leave her alone. She'll wind down eventually. All right, somebody get me a pad of paper. Let's make a list of workouts for every berry at the Berry Works. It's gonna be epic! Fitness! An ice cream sculpture of me and puppies parachuting in from the sky. Oh, and Kiki Key Lime has to be there. And that's what I want for my Raz birthday spectacular. Got it? Uh, Sounds totally. great. Thanks, Berries. <laughs> I was worried this year's celebration wouldn't meet my usual expectations, but with friends like you, I just know it's gonna be the best birthday ever. <laughs> Did you write down what she said? What, is that a doodle of you and Raspberry wearing crowns and sashes while I'm all alone over there? So we're gonna delve deeper into that later, but for now, what are we gonna do for her birthday? Cupcake candle card. Can't argue with the classics. Hmm. Mom, Dad, I know you were worried since you won't be here for my birthday, but my friends are taking care of everything. It's gonna be fantastic. Oh, this is raspberry. Raspberry tart. Call me when you get this, bye. What? 
birthdays are special. I wouldn't wish a bad birthday on my worst enemy and... And, well, that's raspberry. Wait, you want to throw raspberry tart, the best birthday party ever. Yes, raspberry wouldn't do that for you. She wouldn't do that for any berry. Sure, raspberry and I aren't exactly friends, but every berry deserves to have the best birthday. Who doesn't love a birthday? You get the cake, the weird blowy things that make noise. You won't stop speeching until we do this, will you? I will not! Huh? Okay. Oh, let's throw a party! Birthday, Barry. I hope you're excited. I am! I have to be honest, I know it was a lot, and I wasn't sure you two would really do all the things I asked for. <laughs> when you say all the things... <gasps> everything I dreamed of! Right. But, like, we may have missed one or two or... All? No! It's perfect! Huh? <laughs> I cannot believe you two did all this! Uh, um, well, but I... We... Right? They kept telling every berry at the Berry Works how important this birthday was for you. They just wanted you to have the best day ever. We did say that! Only the best for you? <sighs> Red and Sour had nothing to do with this party. Why are you letting them take the credit? Because it'll make Raspberry feel good. Just like it makes me feel good that my friends were willing to help me plan this party, even if they didn't want to. It's a good feeling when you know there are berries who will always be there for you, no matter what. The best thing about living in Big Apple City is there's always something amazing happening. Like today, the Berry Works is holding a golden berry challenge. Yeah, I have no idea what it is, but it sounds cool, and I am going to win. Mess it up! Every berry touches the golden berry. If you break contact for any reason, you're out. Whoever is left touching it at the end wins the secret prize hidden inside. inside of this anyway. Oh, an endless supply of books. <laughs> I'm gonna need more bookmarks. Books? No way. It's a Slicer ZX Kimisaki dirt bike. Sorry. There is no way a kiwisaki fits inside that berry. No one does, though. Spark berries. Enough spark berries to fuel my greatest invention. The machine machine. A machine that makes smaller machines. <laughs> <laughs> What do the smaller machines do? I will get back to you on that. I bet the prize is a perfect song. Oh. 
So, there's like a speaker inside. No, just a song. It will play once and disappear forever. That's an interesting theory. What do you think, Strawberry? <gasps> Sprinkles! Wait, no, no, no. Chocolate chips? No! Sprinkle chips. Coconut flakes with a pinch of... Uh, strawberry? Aw, fiddle faddle! So I guess that means blueberry's the winner? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. This pigeon is so interesting. Uh, with no clear winner, I think the prize goes to... The MC! Actually, I think he's the winner. Frappe was stuck there the entire time? I cannot believe we didn't notice that. You did say whoever was left touching it at the end was the winner. Ugh, fine. The frog is the winner. Ooh, let's see what's inside. It's a gift card to Guava Spava. That's really so boring. Nice. A gift card might not be what we had our hearts set on, but maybe it's exactly what Frappe wanted. What would a frog possibly want with a gift card to a spa? A day for berries who are organized, precise, who love making lists. All right, berries, it's not gonna be easy, but I've strategized a path to victory. Your assignments. That's not so bad. Oh, oh, oh. Before the day is done, the berry works is going to shine. And when we're finished, I have a big surprise for you. <laughs> surprise? <laughs> You're kind of intense about cleaning, huh? Yeah. I'm going to go mop the high line! Woohoo! Well, cleaning is important, and who doesn't love a surprise? Whoa! This will be fun! This is not fun. We are never going to finish! Never fear, berries! With my Dream Queen 3000, we'll be enjoying that surprise in no time! Or not. You're not getting done today. Lime will be pretty disappointed if this place doesn't look amazing. Plus, no surprise. <sighs> if only we had an old abandoned office that Noberry used where we could stuff everything to deal with later. Then the berry works would be clean, Lime would be happy, and we would get our surprise. Why are you all looking at me? <gasps> Can you see my aura? What color is it? We can stick everything here in Jay Quincy Cupcake's old office! I don't know. We'll still do everything Lime asked. We'll just do it later. Oh, Jay Quincy's ghost says that sounds like a delicious plan. He said that? Uh, maybe we should start moving stuff? Uh... Whoa! You're even better cleaners than I thought! Ready for your surprise? <laughs> Follow me! <laughs> um, Lime, where are we going? This is going to be the best surprise ever! Lime! Wait! No! <laughs> this is how you cleaned up? <laughs> Red Pudding said if we cleaned out Jay Quincy's office, we could make it our own special hangout spot. Surprise! But I guess you all found another use for it. Wait, Lime! Oh, I feel awful. What should we do? What we should have done in the first place. Come on, berries. <laughs> Heart! Heart! <laughs> we 
know we messed up and feel awful that we ruined your surprise. So to say we're sorry, we have a surprise for you. Open your eyes. Do berries put everything? Uh. It's fitting we're here at the Cumin Time Museum of Modern Art. Let's see how our bakers did. I love Fight of the City. Kiki Keylime goes all over Big Apple City finding the best bakers. Could there be a more perfect show for me? As these cupcakes show, today's contestants proved a great baker needs to be a great artist as well. Yes, exactly! <laughs> you so get me, Kiki. Do you have what it takes to be the very best in baking? Oh, I do! Then I can't wait to come to your neighborhood and take a bite of the city! <sighs> Hello? Is there a baker in there? Yes, Kiki Key Lime, there really is. Behind you, actually. <gasps> I'm just so happy that you're there, and it's just you're my favorite person. I love you lots. <laughs> I get that a lot. Hi, I'm in a rush to my next shoot, but I do need a quick bite. What have you got? Okay, okay, I can do this. I can totally do this. Don't freak out. Just take a deep breath. <gasps> Today, I am serving Lady Fingers. My cranberry jam taught me how to... Oh, I love Lady Fingers. But I'm wondering if you could add some organic hand-pressed key lime juice. And you know what I love? A hint of Costa Rican coffee where the beans have been sung to. They just have that extra oomph, you know? Also, could you throw on just a dollop of mascarpone cheese? If you can't, it's totally fine. But if you can, that would be more fine. Just need to grab some ingredients. It should take me. I have two minutes and 36 seconds. Custard, you're in charge. <laughs> Orange, tell me you have key limes, please. Nope, just regular limes today. Can you juice it for me? Sure thing. Uh, hand juice it, please. Okay. You're the best, I owe you a cake. Sometimes it's easier not to ask. Lemon! Lime! Do you have Costa Rican beans that have been sung to? Why would I sing to coffee beans? There's no time for crazy questions! Seriously, who sings to beans? Every berry knows you read to them. Um, it was the best of beans. It was the worst of beans. No time! Lemon beans! Oh, hot! The best things in life. That'll do it! I owe you all five! That was weird, right? Blueberry! No need. The universe has spoken. Mascarpone ice cream awaits. But how did you... Shh. You must go. I owe you some cookies. <laughs> Constructed tiramisu. Delicious. That hit the spot. Extraordinary berry, huh? I'll remember that. Bye. Did you hear that, Custard? She'll remember that we did it. Now we can just relax and bask in the glow of this fantastic moment. Ahem. <laughs> Aren't you... We're getting something. Pies. That something is pies. Right after I bake those thank you desserts. <laughs> <laughs> Big Apple City is in a full-on heat wave. Woo! It is hot. How hot? I need a cool off. Oh, hi, Strawberry. Can I interest you in my upside-down ice cream cone? 
I call it the topsy-turvy scoop. If it's cold, count me in. <gasps> Your freezer is broken? Oh, no! All that delicious cold ice cream is gonna melt! Oh, it's gonna be fine. How can you be so calm about this? I'm friends with the universe. Friends with the who now? The universe. Me and the universe have been friends as long as I can remember. Why be worried when I know the universe is always watching? Let me get this straight. Your freezer is broken, your ice cream is melting, but you aren't gonna do anything because... the universe? Oh, I'm gonna do something all right. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Good. Hiya, universe. It's Blueberry. My freezer is having a bit of a day. I was wondering, if it wasn't too much trouble, could you send guidance? I may not be friends with the universe, but luckily I do have a friend who can help. Sunberry got a broken freezer. Oh, that was fast. I knew I could count on my buddy, my pal, my universe. Ice Cube Bot projects waves of cold air wherever he goes. Aww. As long as he doesn't get too hot. Okay, time for plan B. Uh, we'll be okay, right, universe? The fan Tessie 800 attaches to the side of your freezer and blasts the coolest air. It's a little strong. <laughs> Ugh. Okay, fine. Plan C. Universe, any time now. The Mecha Sparkberry Turbo Cooler will freeze everything in the Berry Works, including your freezer. Um, Lemon, quick question. Should the freezing machine be eating up? I'm gonna go with no. My ice cream has melted? Oh, universe! Oh, we aren't the friends I thought we were. Blueberry, we're really sorry. Don't be sorry, friends. It's not you who let me down. It's the universe who... Made ice cream soup. Uh, ice cream soup? Oh! Whoa. Oh, silly me. The universe was right as usual. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What? The universe wanted your ice cream to melt? Ha, I know. That universe so wise. Strawberry, can you bake me some waffle bowls? The universe is just like any friend. Sometimes they see things differently than you. That's when you have to really listen and trust that they're looking out for you. Who wants to beat the heat with a delicious bowl? Oh, yeah! Thanks, friend. Uh, can't argue with the universe. This soup is good. This may be the best cupcake recipe in the history of the universe. It's just missing one super special ingredient. <laughs> right, Lucky Spoon? Right you are, Strawberry. And that ingredient is... I dreamed the very best cupcake recipe. It had this perfect ingredient. It was, um, it, it, uh, it, it was the, hold on, I know this, it, no, I can't remember what it is. Why can't I remember what it is? Come on, strawberry, it can't be that hard. Think, think, think. Uh, shortcakes, you okay? No, I came up with the cupcake recipe of my dreams, in my dreams. But I can't remember the last ingredient. Ooh, I've got just the thing. My Dream Grubber 3000. This baby uses cosmic waves to absorb all of your nighty nighttime thoughts. <laughs> kind of fair. <laughs> eh, it's still in beta testing. This is just like issue 37 of Terrific Tales of Tangerine Smash. Tangerine Smash was trapped in the dream world by her arch enemy, Night Mangle, and couldn't remember how to escape. <gasps> just like me. How did she remember? Her 
sidekick Guava Girl's utility belt gets them out of any jam. Well, a utility belt isn't gonna help with this mental jam. Ow! Ow! Lemon! I'm not wearing the helmet! Why am I getting shocked? Huh, is that a bug? Or a feature? A mystery requires a detective skills. Inspector Sherbet Cones always retraces his steps. What did you do yesterday? I mean, nothing out of the ordinary. I woke up, cleaned my room. <coughs> then I had breakfast. I think it was toast with jam. Ow! Lemon! Oh, this thing is stronger than I thought. What else did you do? Typical day. Hmm. I can help you out. You can? Sure. Follow me. To remember your dream, you need sleep. To sleep, you need to be zen. To be zen, you need to meditate. Uh, uh, um, Strawberry, what are you doing? Seeing if any ingredients jog my memory. Chocolate, peanut butter, jam. Ow! Bean grabber, more like shock maker. Shock maker, huh? You don't happen to have a patent on that, do you? My friends were trying, but they were not helping. Seriously, not helping. If only my lucky spoon could talk, then. Ah! Top press buns! If I get one more. Wait a second. Gonna help with this mental jam. <laughs> jam. Jam! Ow! Jam! Ow! That's the ingredient! The shocks were from J-A-M! Yes! Lemon's machine worked! Oh, my friends helped after all. Well, they're gonna be the first ones to taste my dream recipe. Ow! Here you go. Try it. Oh, you're gonna love it. So, what do you think? Now that's what I call baking it happen. Good job, Strawberry. Presenting my world-famous Choco Mint Pie! I just need to clip some leaves from my mint on the roof. Yeah, that mint grew fast. If it isn't carefully tended to, it can run over anything in its path. I can take care of that easy peasy. With what, clippers? Uh, something like that. <laughs> the Incinerate 5000. I'll go get it. Have you seen Lemon use that thing? Wait up, Lemon, let me help you. <laughs> Yeah, I don't see this ending well. There are less destructive ways to take care of an overgrown plant. Clint would never forgive himself if anything happened to his friends. Clint? Who's Clint? The mint. You know I speak plant. I think I speak for all plants when I say plants can't speak. According to Farmer Fig's latest guide to gardening, the first thing we need to do is trim the vines. Wait! You can't cut his vines now! Clint's playing rock, paper, scissors. Great move. Another W for the Clintster. <laughs> yes, Gerald, I know a piece of paper wouldn't beat a rock in real life. This guy. Farmer Fig says spraying a solution of salt, soap, and vinegar will tame unwanted plant growth. Clint, old chum, I'm here for you. Tell this berry what we should do. Whoa, you're trying to make Clint sad. Soap, salt, and vinegar smells real bad. Mm. Clint says I should go on tour. Ah, oh, what a charmer. We'll never get this done if Blueberry shoots down every idea. Then maybe ask her what she thinks. She thinks she speaks plant. We don't always need to agree with our friends. Just listen to them. Blueberry, what do you think we should do? It's not about me. Let's ask Clint. 
Just so you know, Farmer Fig says that if we dig the mint roots up, we can... Move, move them into its, its own pot! pot. <gasps> Did you just agree with Farmer Fig? No. Clint agreed with Farmer Fig. He also said he'd be most comfortable if you did the digging line. He trusts you. You're really smart. Bye, Clint! I still don't believe that plants can talk. But it was nice of you to say I was smart. Thank you, Clint. <gasps> Aww. And done. Here you go. Thanks, Thanks strawberry. strawberry. <laughs> All right. It's incinerate time! <laughs> Actually, blueberry and lime work together to take care of the mint. But I saved you some pie. Let's do this! Orange, pull! <laughs> oh, I meant for you to eat that. I love the smell of burnt pie in the morning. Anybody else done? Uh. <laughs> 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 No, 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 I can't be sick. There's no time. I need 500 cupcakes for Sweetie Pie Preschool's annual bake sale, baked and ready by five o'clock today. Ha oh. Sorry. Wow, you look terrible. You should really go rest. I can't. I need to get these cupcakes done. It's for the kids. <gasps> How about we help with the baking? Every berry needs some berry sometimes, shortcakes. I don't know if that's the best. Huh? Huh? <laughs> <sighs> hey! uh oh. Okay, fine. Orange, you're gonna weigh out the dry ingredients here. Lemon, you stand here and combine the wet ingredients, and then we're gonna pass it to Blueberry. Wow, you really captured my aura. Uh, don't worry. We got this. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go rest of the clubhouse. Text me if you need anything. And don't forget, an extra large egg is better than a regular large egg. All right, girls. Let's make our sweet, but very easily stressed out friend proud. Let's yeah. do this. <gasps> it's like looking in a mirror. Blueberry, focus. Did you hear that? It said my name. Hmm, if I use the best methods from each book, I'll make perfect cupcakes. Butter must be super cold, got it? <gasps> huh? Wait, this says room temperature butter is best. Which is it? Hey! <laughs> no recipes, no rules. Just me and Egg Sheeran. Vibing. Five cups of sugar? That's unhealthy. How about no cups of sugar? <gasps> and maybe some powdered veggies to add some nutrients. Mm. Yum! So healthy. Thanks, Custard, but I am not tired, so... That's it. Never leave home without my super duper piping bag 3000. <sighs> I feel so much better, Custard. You know what? It is so nice to have friends who can be there for you and keep you calm, keep you relaxed, keep you freaking out! What did you do? I'm calling it the unbearable icing of being. Ugh. I never made it past the butter. Oh no, I have to deliver 500 cupcakes uh, now, and nothing is done! Sorry, shortcakes. We tried, but we're just not the bakers you are. But how did this happen? 
You each did something totally different. You did whatever you wanted without any kind of... Wait a minute. That's it. You guys are geniuses. We are. Is she still hallucinating? <laughs> Looks like my build your own cupcake stand is a hit. And honestly, I never would have come up with the idea if you all hadn't messed up so badly. Thank you for being such terrible bakers. And for helping when I needed it. Anytime. <gasps> Lemon, no! <laughs> <laughs> I meant to do that. No! Hot cross buns, this is horrible! What's with all the yelling? My strawberry pies. I set them out to cool and look! I even put a sign out. Hot pies, only eat when cool. But now, some berry decides to come along and gobble them up. This really bakes my bread, you know? Who would do such a horrible thing? Oh, I can find the culprit. Yes! Lime is an awesome detective. Is that a donut? Crack a clue, take a bite. I've read a lot of Apricot Christie mysteries. I know all the tricks to find the who, what, where, when, and hi. Huh? Mm. Also, I really like donuts. I don't think there are many clues to go on. It's all just a mess. Yes, this crime scene is a mess. No berry would eat pie like this. We are clearly looking for an animal. An animal? <gasps> this cat's paws don't match the markings in your pies. Therefore, she is innocent. Ha. Wow, you are good. Oh, I'm just getting started. Red Hot the Ferret, our next suspect. He is? What do you know about it, Ferret? Get out of town. Red Hot would never steal from a baker as sweet and generous as Strawberry. Aww. Thank you, Huck. Besides, he's been with me all day. Uh, hey, let us help. Leave no bag of flour unturned, no critter unquestioned, no pie left behind. I checked every animal, followed every lead, but I had nothing. Are you narrating right now? Here, Huck, you can have the last bite. I don't deserve it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, it's okay, Lime. You tried your best. I'll just have to keep a closer eye on- Huckleberry Pie did it. <gasps> I would never. You ate my donut like an animal. Just like the pies. Why would I steal from Strawberry? She gives me pies for free. Um, say what now? Her sign said, hot pies only eat when cool. Strawberry likes my music. She thinks I'm cool. So she leaves those pies out for me. That's not what the sign means, is it? Not, not even a little. Wow. I stole the pies, didn't I? Yeah, uh -huh. totally. Just wow. Oh, I'm sorry, Strawberry. I really did think those were thank you pies for my smooth and jazzy tunes. I do think you're cool, and your tunes are very smooth and jazzy. <laughs> Just check with me next time. There's still one mystery left. Why do you eat pies like that? Big Apple Fair's pie eating champion, three years in a row. No better way to enjoy a pie. Okay, fairies, on your mark. Get set. Go! <laughs> Pies do taste better this way. Another mystery solved. Three emails, two meetings, and one yoga class, and then I am good to go. Perfect. As soon as I finish these strawberry jelly donuts, I'll meet you at Garscone. <laughs> Garscone? Aunt Praline is taking me out for a girls' night. W-O-W, Garscone is the hottest 
best restaurant in Big Apple City. The food is... What are you gonna wear? I'm just gonna wear this. Close the truck. We're going shopping. I am not fancy. I don't need to get all dressed up to have dinner with my aunt. Strawberry has to get dressed up to have dinner with her aunt. It's Garscone! Blooming Berries is the place to find the perfect look for tonight. I don't know, Lime. This just seems too fancy for me. <laughs> uh, why are you looking at me like that? Really flowy fantasy. Go big, go bold, be fun, be free. Really flowy fantasy. Go big, go bold, be fun, be free. A fancy night out on the town. That's super fun, so lose that frown. Let's go get you ready for your big night. Big night. Okay, you don't know what to wear. You got this girl, so don't despair. Time to get you ready for the fun. Garscone. It's just not really perfect for me. You know what? I I'm not hungry anyway. Maybe I'll just tell Aunt Paling we can rain check for another night. Maybe when it comes to dress up, I can get a teensy bit carried away. <laughs> huh? <gasps> Wait! Jelly donut! Jelly what now? Nobody cares what's on the outside of a jelly donut. It's what's inside that matters. Dressing up is fun, but I know that no matter what you wear, you're gonna be a huge hit. You're you. Be your free best. Don't worry, don't be stressed. Find a look that makes you feel like you. Shine brighter than a star just by being who you are. That's the very best thing you can do. You look fabulous. That is all thanks to my fashion guru, Lime Chiffon. Clearly. I mean, you look very fashion forward. I always try to look my very best. <laughs> 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 Buddy, uh, I'm assuming this issue of the terrific tales of Tangerine Smash is yours and not Pupcake's? It's Pupcake's hmm. new game. Take my favorite stuff to get chased, not a fan. What are you two doing? Oh, uh, Custard is just helping me train with my lucky spoon by hurling dough at my head when I'm not looking. You country berries do weird stuff with your pets. What? This spoon is lucky. It's been passed down in my family from baker to baker to me. The extraordinary berry would not be as successful without it. You don't believe that, do you? Well, why wouldn't I? Shortcakes. Berries like us are successful because we work hard, not because of a silly old spoon. What's so silly about believing a spoon is magical and lucky and looking out for you and wants the best and loves you for who you are? Really? Listen, shortcake. <laughs> My spoon! I need it! Cupcake! No! We'll get your normal, not lucky spoon back! You don't know it's not lucky. The more I see, things work for me. I know good luck helped me through. My life is great, just trusting fate. I'm making all my dreams come true. 
true That's not what I see This is how it should be Hard work's the very best guarantee Luck's not a plan And fate not a fan My dreams come true because of me But there's more than one way To make all of our dreams come true So much more than one way Yeah, there's more than one way To do what we wanna do There's more, more than one way We're champions We're saving our own day No matter how you slice it There's more than one way We're champions We're saving our own day Keep going till you make it There's more than one way There's me and you Best friends, it's true Although we do things differently Hey, that's okay We do it our own way It's clearly working, we agree Shortcake, Kiki Key Lime, host of Bite of the City. I know! Yeah! You remember me? Sure! The hard working berry with the fab truck at the berry works. Yes, hard working. Exactly. I was actually just thinking about where to shoot our next episode. What about the berry works? Yes! Sorry, yes! Wow! That'd be great. I think so too. Gotta run. Catch you later. Bye! I love you! Lucky I ran into you. Oh, yeah, it sure was. Lucky. That's just a coincidence. Uh, excuse me? We're looking for extras for the new Tangerine Smash movie. Either of you Tangerine Smash fans? <gasps> me! I love Tangerine Smash! You were saying? No way! <gasps> no! <laughs> <laughs> ah! Not again! It's Sweetie Pie's day. It's Sweetie Pie's Day! A.K.A. the sweetest holiday, A.K.A. the day when I get my sweet friends the sweetest presents I can to show how much I love them! A.K.A. love is in the air. <gasps> a meditation pillow shaped like a chocolate bar. <gasps> Tranquil and tasty. Ooh, I love you, Bunches Blueberry! A chocolate trophy? For the sweetest smoothie maker I know. Shortcakes? Orange, you glad I love you, Orange? Get it? Orange? Because your name is. <clears throat> yeah, I'll workshop that a bit. <gasps> a book about chocolate made of chocolate? Lots of love for you! Woo! <laughs> to cocoa bean or not to cocoa bean? Day. I just want to give you your Sweetie Pie's Day present. I don't want it! <sighs> Look, it's nothing personal, but personally, I hate Sweetie Pie's Day. <laughs> but why? Sweetie Pie's Day is all about love? Ooh, the 
feelings. Handwritten cards. Oh, writing about feelings. And hugs. Hugs are the worst. Down with hugs. Lemon, don't you want to show your friends how much you love them? Of course I do, but Sweetie Pie's Day, it's all about sharing your feelings. Oh, every berry gives me stuff and I don't know what to do or say and it just makes me feel weird. Okay, no feelings. Just open it. A chocolate bolt? You show us you care all the time with your ingenious inventions, like my amazing berry berry oven. So this is my way of saying thank you for all the times you show us how much you care. Your way. Huh. I know, it's Sweetie Pie's day, and you won't want to talk feelings and stuff, but since I don't want to, I thought I'd show you how much you mean to me instead. With this little invention I like to call the Meister 3000! Hugs aren't my thing, but this guy loves them. But I think you just shared some feelings. Turns out, I like to show I care, just in my own way. Honestly, the best hugs are the ones I don't need to be a part of. Group hug, everybody! Oh, I love you so much! Perfect. Everything is going fantastic at Berry Works. Huckleberry Pie is fitting right in, and even bread pudding is cooled off. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> What's wrong with the little music? It's a lot of music everywhere. I can't escape it. Just stay by your... You don't have a cart. Nope. I go where the song takes me. <laughs> Thing is, all Berry Works vendors need carts. No cart? No you. <sighs> no sad strumming without a cart. Bread pudding is correct. Every berry working needs a cart. <gasps> That's it! Huck can just work out one of our carts. It's a total win-win. Huck gets to stay, we get the help. Three blue blasts, two green meanies, one orange deluxe. Got that, Huck? Orders. I need a large lemon lime barricade blaster, extra syrup, half ice. You need a small, large, extra syrup, half syrup, half a berry, half ice. Uh, got it. Right, right, uh, blast the syrup. No! <laughs> uh, Maybe help lemon instead. Wrench. Uh, no, no. No. Where did the chicken come from? Oh. Inspire us with creative new flavors. Oh, close your eyes. What do you see? I see vanilla. Uh, anything else? Vanilla ice cream. Maybe something more daring? Vanilla ice cream in a cone. Mind blown. Your energy is simple. You should share it with the world. Just not here. Okay, let's see how you do baking orders. The oven gets hot quickly, so... Make sure you use oven mitts. And... I keep the mitts right... Huh? What is happening? Nothing. It's good that music's my passion. I'm no good at anything else. I'm really, really sorry, Huck. No tears, my song will never end Because I have you, my awesome friends Who love my art, with or without a cart. <gasps> That's it! Instead of Huck,
of working in our carts, we needed to help him get one of his own. The Huckleberry Pie Karaoke Cart! You all did this for me? Wow. Hey, why are you still here? I told you, no cart, no way! And there is nothing that can change... Look, Brad, the girls made me my very own karaoke music cart. Karaoke? Very, very, so contrary. Shake it up, pick it up, pick me if I make it up, or you're gonna whisk me away. This is for smoothest smoothie. Most protein-packed smoothie. Ooh, tootiest, fruitiest smoothie. Every berry cleared up pretty quickly for that one. Woo, woo! Wow, Orange, that is a lot of trophies. But not all of them. I've won every trophy at the Splendidly Scrumptious Smoothie Competition except one. Most creative smoothie. Huh, how come? I like structure, rules, goals. Creativity is just making stuff up. How can you win at that? <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Orange needs a crash course in creativity. I mean, if only we knew the perfect berry to help her out. <laughs> wink, wink. <laughs> uh, you sure about this, Shortcakes? Blueberry's the most creative berry we know. She can totally teach you. Right, Blueberry? The first rule of creativity is... There are no rules! <laughs> Uh-uh. Oh, just give her a chance. Yeah, give her a chance. <laughs> Who are we talking about? Meet the fruit. Feel the fruit. Taste the fruit. No! Be the fruit. None of this makes any sense! Ah! Kinda of pretty? You're getting it. Orange's creative side. Orange's inner artist could always sing. I just turned up the volume. Ooh, uh, how high did you turn it up? Berries, stop your blending. Great <laughs> <laughs> job, Orange. Oh, that's mine. <laughs> What do we think? Does his face say, wow, this is so creative? Well... Uh, oh, it tastes like juicy socks. Maybe? It's okay, Orange. Most artists don't get the respect they deserve until they're dead. <clears throat> Before we declare a winner, we have an announcement. The judges decided to create an entirely new category for one of this year's more unique entries. So, the award for Worst Smoothie goes to... Orange Blossom! <gasps> worst Smoothie? Created just for me? This is way better than most creative! My own category! Who's the best at being the worst? Oh, this yeah. berry right here! I guess that's the thing about creativity. It's not about being the best. But I am the best at being the worst! <laughs> it's about being you. Exactly. Art is a journey. Eh, just go with it. Yoo-hoo! A luxurious lime! <laughs> Get rid of that basic bev and try this. The Elderflower Lemon Icy from Peels of Plenty. The best drink cart in Big Apple City. Welcome. Uh, what was that about? Bread pudding's been acting really weird all week. Try these hair ties. They're less black than yours. Welcome. Mm. 
here. The history of doorstops? Yeah. Books are your thing. Welcome. You have to up your frame game. Red, my glasses have a really strong prescription. <laughs> Welcome. I think he's trying to be nice. That's even scarier. I'm getting to the bottom of this. Mm -hmm. Red, <gasps> you're being nice to Lime in a weird snooty way. Why? What do you mean? Look, I know you and the other Mean Berries don't like me. Mean Berries? Seriously? Look. I'm a big Lime Chiffin. She's the only other berry around here with any style. Obviously, since her dad is Fluffy Chiffon, the biggest designer in Big Apple City. You knew that, right? Sure I knew that. Yeah. I did not know that. Well, he just released the Fluffy Chiffon All-Season Multi-Weather Limited Edition Waistcoat. I have the best connections in the city, but I still can't get one. No. Huh? No. Hmm? Uh, yes! <gasps> No. Aww. So, you're using a sweet, smart berry like Lime to get some vest? No! I did some nice stuff for Lime, a berry I could be friends with, so she would be nice and get me a waist coat. You gave her a lemon icy from some other card, a book she won't read, glasses she can't wear, and you insulted her hair ties. Have you seen her hair ties? Maybe Lime would help you if you were just honest. Right! Honestly, tell some Barry who barely knows me that I want a waistcoat her dad designed? Why would she help me? Because that's how friendships work. If you really think you'd like to be friends with Lime, then try being her friend. Trust me, because I am really good at friendship. Uh, hi, Lime. So... What Bev would you recommend? Sure you don't want to drink from Peels O' Plenty. Sorry about that. And about the book. Thank you. Listen. Not done. If you like the glasses, I can get your crazy prescription put in, no problem. Oh, that's very... Still not done. Your hair is fab, and the new hair ties would show it off more. But yours aren't blech. Oh, wow. I... Almost there. I did all that so you'd help me get your dad's new waistcoat. But I'm also a big Lime Chiffin. You're just so you. Then why are you always so you? I wasn't always a trendsetter. I used to be shy and a tad klutzy. And sometimes it's easier to make fun of other berries before they make fun of you. But some berry said I should try being honest. So, I don't care about the waistcoat, but I would like to get to know you better. Behind you. <laughs> my goodness, are you okay? Your, your... Bread pudding, this is my dad. Dad, bread pudding. Oh, then this is yours. Oh, I'm gumdrops. Uh, why? I may have overheard your chat with Strawberry. I'd like to get to know you better, too. You're kind of funny when you're not being snooty. But right now, you have a waistcoat to try on. <sighs> Sweetheart, it's on backwards. Oh! Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> See, Custard, I told you I was good at friendship. <laughs> <laughs>